远。So the prop performance to put it on your knees like that, yep. grab the other end. It's not as heavy as you think it is. Okay. And then you just okay. under your shoulders. And it's gonna wanna lean back so you keep your arms here. So you can bring it up close to you so you can reach it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then you just <laughs> pop it up under your shoulders. <laughs> I can't flip it. Okay. <laughs> I know you can. Can I grab it by this? Ah! <laughs> okay.
also have granola bars in the thing. And then rice krispies for his left. Cool. And we can also have oatmeal as a snack. We need to eat the hot dogs today though. How was that? Good. So when we checked in, um, Gemma went to go grab the canoe, and uh, I guess the guy that was dealing with her warned us that right where we're staying on night two, which is where we're heading to right now, there's a there's like a bear issue. <laughs> but the way he explained it was so funny. It was like this bear is big, this bear is smart. It's like we've never seen anything like this before. <laughs> Apparently he's just like approaching people like midday, like he'll see people and go towards them because he knows that they have food. He's betting on us or the bear. Oh yeah, he said if the bear goes for your food, just let him have it because between you and me, like I'm, my money's on the bear. So hopefully now in the video it'll just cut to like shaky footage of me squaring up with a bear, like just full unboxing. <laughs> Like jujitsu. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, he clearly has no idea how paranoid I am. Oh yeah, I'm like, I'll be tying it up, man. Don't worry. And he's like, Yeah, yeah, good. Because look at this. He just shows me a bear barrel full of teeth marks, like ripped apart. I'm like, okay. not over yet we'll see Gemma did a 1200 meter portage without any breaks so that was pretty cool we well, break for like a second a second <laughs> That's good. Fuck. Is it high enough? Yeah. It's fine. That's no, good. It's done. Yeah, it's done. <laughs> God. <laughs> I hate that so much. Well, look at the beers. I'm gonna drink a beer.
trying to find wood. I am not doing so well. Okay, so <laughs> Gemma woke me up in the middle of the night because she heard our barrel smash against the ground. And I was like, it's probably just raccoons. <laughs> and then we heard, I heard like something like pressing on it and then Gemma says she heard something carried up the hill. So we got out the bear bangers and the bear spray. And if you'll turn your attention, there, the bear barrel is completely gone. It got carried off up the fucking, up the cliff. I am so pissed. But you're... Oh yeah, thank God my pants here. It's bent almost in half, and then the handle's missing. It's like everything else though. I wonder what I'm mad at the fan. It's like, fuck! <laughs> Ropes are moving. I, yeah, it must have. Where's the side of that rope? It just like chewed or cut through the rope and then dropped it. God. <laughs> no breakfast, Gemma. <laughs> Hey! You hear him, right? Hey. You don't have anything else, sir. That bear banger should have scared him off.
if I've woken everybody on the lake up. I know, first outdoor camping experience and you have to deal with this shit. This has never happened to me. Is it okay? I'm a little shaky. You left that bear bear, so I think you might have seen the bear bear already. Yeah. Because it was coming towards us. Mm. I thought it, like, I didn't know for sure it was a bear, and then I heard it go like, <laughs> One sec. I'm not going anywhere. Yeah, we know. Yeah. Trap's not working. Long side of the lake. Yeah. Where's Flair's being shot out again? <laughs> <laughs> 